Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Melissa. If it is your first time here, welcome. I am so glad to have you here joining me today. And if you're returning, welcome back. I do hope that if you enjoyed today's video that you might consider liking, subscribing, and maybe leaving me a comment down below. I will also leave my email address if you care to contact me that way. Please feel free to do so. Today I have a collaboration. Yes, I do. Um, I was invited to do a collaboration with the queen of Aspinall. She is the queen. It is Maria Louise Loves Luxury, and she has so many beautiful pieces of Aspinall of London and knows so much about the brand. She's been to the store. She's like Mother Aspinall. Yes, she is to me. And she's the one who got me so into this brand. So thank you, Maria, for inviting me today. And along on this uh, collab, we have Dawn from Dawn Loves Couture. She is a uh, part of the collab today too. So the three of us obviously um, love Aspinall of London and have placed some orders that we are going to share with you today. So after watching my video, I hope that you will go over and watch Maria Louise Loves Luxuries and Don Loves Couture, their videos. And I'm going to link them down below to make it nice and easy for you to be able to go and find um, just, you know, point click and it'll take you right there and you can watch what they have to share with you today. So I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. And I really do. I don't like it when people say it. Without further ado. Yes, without further ado. Let's get into the Aspinall of London. All right. You guys know I have been so into the Aspinall of London lately. Um, the Strathbury and the Demoliers of London. I have just been trying different things. But the, the Strathbury and the Aspinall is just hitting my heart. It just is. I'm just in love with it so much. Um, I have a few pieces of the Demoliers of London and I have, let's see, one, two, three pieces of Strathberry, but um, I would have to like literally just like sit and count to see where I'm at in the Aspinall right now because it has taken over. Yes, it has. So you guys have seen that. I've got all the videos that are, um, going to be, you know, part of this to where you can go back and take a look at if you care to, to see what other Aspinals of London I have. But today, it's all about this baby right here. There's actually two babies in here. Yes, there is. There's two. I couldn't go for just one. No, I had to go for two. Now, after these two I unbox for you, there is one other bag that is huge on my radar. That is just like, okay, it's, it's hurting. It's, it's starting to hurt. I need it. I need it. Okay, I don't need it. I want it. I want it really bad. But I'm saying, no, no, no. Slow your row. Go in reverse. We got to hold still for a few minutes because, you know, I, I need to wait. Yes, I just can't just keep ordering things, you know, all these things. Although these are less expensive bags, they're still pretty darn expensive. I don't care how you look at it. They are. To me, these are luxury bags. These are the most beautiful, the most beautiful leather, the designs, everything about this. To me, this is pure luxury. I don't need all those other luxury name brands. I'm so happy with this. To me, this is like the epitome. This is, this is it. This is my, okay, it's not my holy grail, but um, it's, 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 it's getting up there. I do love it. So let me share with you what I got. Let's start with the baby first. Now these bags come in different sizes. I'm going to show you. I have two, two bags, two bags. We got the mama. We got the little sister or daughter, something like that. So we'll start with the smaller one first. Now I knew I had to have these. And also I'm going to mention their um, Eva of uh, Fuchsia Floyd. She got me going on this bag too. So Eva, yes, thank you. <laughs> Let me share this with you guys. I'm going to pull, pull it out. I am going to undress her. Yes, it is the Lottie. This is the silver pebble Lottie in the regular size. I'm going to pull out her straps here. 
I haven't even had a chance to look at her. Oh, she does have, I'm going to pull out some of her little guts in here. Oh, she's beautiful. She does have uh, two compartments and she has a blue interior. She has that center zip pocket, but she also has a slip pocket in the back here. Oh, great zipper. Butter, butter, I tell you, she is butter. And you know I'm a bag sniffer. And she passes the sniff test. Yes, she does. She passes the sniff test. Okay. She has this great closure. I think it's called the mail, like a mailbox type of a, a closure. At least that's what I've heard. To where that little thing, you can see it's popping up right there. Slips right over. And then it just, oops, i got to have it shut. Pops down. There she is, just like that. She also has a back pocket with a magnet. You can hear it right there, closure. Um, to be able, I think I, my cell phone would fit in there, no problem. You can carry her as a shoulder bag. Yeah, she fits quite nicely. Um, you can wear her also just like this as a long shoulder bag. And being that the strap is not adjustable, let's see. Oh, you know, I can wear her as a crossbody too if I wanted to. And for me, a lot of times when a strap is not adjustable, I'm not able to participate in that because, yeah, you know, Justy. So this I can, and it hits in the sweet spot. That sweet spot, you know, it's right there. It's just right there. So A plus on crossbody with this. I'm going to show you her strap. Her strap is silver because she has a silver bag. She has silver hardware, but she also has that silver pebble um, going through, intertwined in this um, strap right here. Oh my goodness. She is gorgeous. Now this is the regular size Lottie. She also comes in a large, uh, I believe she comes in a mini and a micro. So can you imagine the micro, how small it is? Now, Future Floyd does have one. I think she just purchased a micro and it is small, but it is mighty. So you might want to take a look at her video. I'll link her down below too. So you can take a look at her um, Lotties in the micro. She has the large, she has the regular. So you can take a look at those too. So you go check out Eva also because there's some great videos. But look at this. I'm going to take a measurement of her. She's a gorgeous bag. Now, I know metallics are supposed to be really, really big this year. They are. They're supposed to be big. And I have some metallic shoes. So, hey, I've got the shoes. Now I have the bags. I know a lot of people think metallics are too dressy for the daytime and strictly evening. But you know what? I do what I want. Yes, I do. And I would wear this with a pair of jeans, a pair of boots. My, oh, I have... um some Tory Birch, some silver uh, clouds that I got last year. Okay, yeah, those two, these two are going to go together. They're going to be best friends. Yes, they are. So yeah, when it comes to things and, you know, like metallics at night or shiny sequins at night, I just do what I want. You know what? I, I'm, I can just, I'm old enough. I can make that decision to do what I want. So it is seven inches across. She is, I would say five inches in height. And her base, oh, look at her feet. Look at these cute little feet, tickle, tickle, tickle. Aren't they cute? She's about almost three inches, I'd say two and three quarters, um, almost three in her width. So yeah, you're gonna be able to get a lot of things in here. And I love this back pocket. And I love those little feet. She doesn't have plastic on them. I don't know, um, but she's too cute. Okay, this is bag number one. I know, now we gotta do the big one. Can you guess? Yes, it is. Also, and you know, I, how many times have I told you I love these dust bags? The last bag I got, uh, not this one, but the one before that, which was the uh, Mayfair, came in a blue bag. Yes, it came in a blue bag. I like it too, but these are my favorite. Okay, 
So since I got the baby, uh, I'm not going to call it the baby. It's the regular in the silver. I got the mama and I got the mama in this champagne color. It's a champagne gold and it is just beautiful. This is the large latte. So it opens the same way. It just pops open. You can see right here. And then flip to go to the inside. Let's take some of her stuff in out too so you can see her. Now this one, you're going to be able to carry your, your sink in it. Yeah, you are. I love it. I've got this front pocket. I've got this back pocket and a center zip like butter. Yes, and I'll have to peel all of her plastic off and everything, but she has the slip pocket on the back with the magnet and this beautiful champagne gold strap. I mean, this isn't chintzy, like a chintzy chain at all. It's a nice, I don't know if you can hear, but it's it's a it's a good weight to the chain. It's not cheap at all. I don't like cheap chains. No, I don't. And she's got that leather going through it. Oh, and she passes the sniff test. Yes, she does. Oh my goodness, I am loving this bag. So let's take a look. Yes, she's all leather in here too. Just gorgeous. Now there, um, Dawn on Dawn Loves Couture, I know she got this bag a little bit ago, I think a few weeks ago, and she has a review on this one too. And here's her feet. And oh, she has plastic on her feet. So I'll have to remove that. But is this not gorgeous? And again, yes, it is metallic and I have things to go with it. But she's not like a, I'm going to see if I can get it in the light toy. You can see she's not like a super loud metallic. You know, she's, she's, she's fairly muted. I would say she's um, pretty much a neutral, but she is metallic. And so I know people have the rules of they don't carry metallics, but girl, I'm going to carry this. I'll wear jeans. I will wear my capris. I will wear a skirt. I don't care. I'm going to wear this and wear her quite happily. Yes, I am. So that was on the shoulder. Let me see now. Long. Yes. Love it. Perfect. And now let's see if she passes the crossbody. Oh, goodness. She passes the crossbody too. She has room to accommodate. Accommodate what I need her to accommodate. Yes. Oh, my gosh. I am loving this bag. Yes, I am. Oh, you know, like I said, Aspinall, they have stolen my heart and my money. Not really. I've been giving it to them of free will. But I'm going to just put a little more stuffing in here so I can show you her. I just love that closure, too. That is just so stinking cute. So I'm going to show you them. Both together in just a minute. I'm going to give you some measurements on this real fast. Real fast. Just real fast. She is 10 inches across. So, yeah. Big difference. Her height is 7. So, a little bit difference there. And going across the width of the base, she is 3 inches. So, I'm going to put them both together so you can see them. Oh my goodness, they are so cute. Let's take a look at them both together. So this is the large and the regular. And that's quite a big bit of difference to me between the large and the regular size. Um, but I love them both because this is small, but it's not too small for me. Um, the micro, I think, would be pushing it too far for me. Um, probably also the, the mini, I think, would be too small for me. Um, but these are just perfect. Let's put them this way for you to see them too. So you can see right there. There's not a whole lot of difference as far as the, the width. But yeah, there's there's a major difference that way. And then I'm going to hold them up this way for you to see too. And you can see, yeah. So I've got one for when I need a lot and when I don't need as much. But I think... I'm going to use this one quite comfortably. And her, I'm just loving. 
Yeah. Oh, and Yoda of Yoda Style, she did purchase, I believe it was this one in this color also, but um, I think she is going, she is selling hers for, you know, she just decided it wasn't for her, but you might want to check her channel out too. Oh, list it. So if you're interested in picking this up, she might still have it. I don't know, but if you're lucky, jump on it because it is so pretty. All right. I want to thank Maria. Maria Loves Luxury for inviting me to do this with her today and Dawn for doing it also with us. I cannot wait to see what they got because I don't know. I don't know what they have. So I'm going to be checking out their channels too and watching their videos of what they received. Um, but yeah, it's all because of Maria that I really did find this brand and um, enjoying it so much. She is the queen of Aspinall. So if you have any questions, I would say go and ask her because she has such a huge collection of the Aspinall London. She's going to be able to probably answer most any questions that you have. Last thing I wanted to show though before I go is the, the difference between the silver and this um, champagne gold that they use on their chains and the difference in the leather right there. Isn't that beautiful? I think that is just gorgeous. It's like jewelry. It's like jewelry on your bag. So yes, I am so impressed. So thank you so much for joining me today and exploring my new Aspinall of London purchases. Um, like I said, there is one more bag. It is just like, it's right there. It's just right there. I just, I just like an itch. I need to itch it. I need to get it. And then I think I'll be happy. Um, not that it would make me happy, but it'll be just, oh, it's going to make me happy. <laughs> not going to lie. It's true. All right, guys, I will see you later. I'll catch you in my next video. But until I see you next time, have a great day and I'll see you then. Bye.